Hello viewers, this is Soma part 10. I hope you enjoyed the video and I'll see you in the next one. Alright, let's continue. Let's see what wants us to go down there. Mr. Chinese, Mr. Chinese, look. Who is the Chinese who did things? Look. Their black boxes are back full. Global lockdown active. All right, all dive room consoles. What was that? Okay, we need to find you a power suit. 
You know, so we can go into the abyss without ending up like a recycled can of soda? You think we'll find one that fits me? I mean, I'm kind of in a suit already. That's been bothering me too. You know how you were transferred from Vancouver? Toronto. From then to now. <clears throat> how could I forget? Okay, so, we do it again. You want to send me to the future? No, you idiot. I want to transfer your mind into a new body. What? Look, we already know it can be done. We don't need to make it a big deal. It is a big deal, Kath. It's a huge fucking deal. There's got to be something else that can take us down there. But Dunbat at Theta was the only vessel that could take that pressure, and you saw what happened. Then think of something else. Simon, please. You don't have to switch this instant. Just play along for now. If we find something else, then great. If not... I'm not promising anything. Thank you, Simon. Have a look around the room. This is where they would keep the power suits, if there are any left. I found one of the power suits. There's a dead woman inside. At least I think it's a woman. Just like the body. What about the wow? How does that what work? The body the decomposes, along? though. It's not magic. It's algorithms. A set pattern. The wow won't be able to deny us, even if it was capable of wanting to. I'm still not crazy about this plan. It feels wrong. Please, Simon. I can't give up on the Ark. I need this to work. So we need a Cortex chip, structure gel, and a battery pack. That's one hell of a shopping list. Thanks. I'll just hang around here if that's okay. I'll be back. Don't forget, we need a Cortex chip, structure gel, and a power pack to get the suit ready. So we are now on the lower part.
roughly Nearly Saturday orange roughly found hovering outside Omicron substation. It has a remarkable bone growth that seemed to interfere with its perceptions. I brought it inside to study it, but it stiffened and died in the process. During postmortem study, the thing kicked back to life while being cut, being out of water. Kept swimming for a few minutes, so I returned it to the aquarium. It instantly started banging into the glass and bunched it itself to death before it could before I could locate it. Darby and Wacky identified it as what was sabotaging the Lumer probe at about 900 meter depths. It's 150 centimeters long rudder fish that looks like it has merged from more than more other kinds of fish or sharks. It's the freakiest form of mutation I've ever seen so far. It's clear that it's getting worse. Something is causing this and <coughs> I'm not buying the radioactive fallout nonsense that Ori can't shut up, shut up about. The dead man found out the climber at uh, the climber this morning had been identified as John Ross. Uh, John. Johan Ross, the AI psychologist, psychologist, worked with Tao, I can't even begin to imagine what has happened down in the bus and freak and freaky I don't risk losing my staff by going down there to look. If the art team is alive, which is which I highly doubt, they will have to find a way to give us a sign. We're not going down there without any good reason. that thing. Freaky fish. Previous results, etc. So they were experimenting down here, and then something went wrong. Something is that speed. Never, never need. It's never seen something of that speed.
so one. Okay, we got the gel. Now we need the cortex chip and another thing. What are you? What are you? No message. Oh, he doesn't have it. No message. Chilling, watching some YouTube. Johan Ross was found dead on the climber this morning. The ARC team went down a couple of days ago, but I see no reason to suspect them playing a part in his death. The climber can't be operated from the abyss, so there was a scheduled retrieval. The climber returned with only the lifeless body of Alpha member Johan Ross. No traces of the ARC team. Cameron, Eames, Lansky. All studying the body inside containment. I'll follow up with whatever they find. Delenda Est. The WoW has been getting more aggressive. Pushing all systems to their limits. Ironically, the dead Dr. Johan Ross would be the perfect person to ask why the WoW is making such a big buzz about his passing. After all, the WoW isn't supposed to want anything. And definitely not to mourn people. Things are out of hand. The staff looks like they're about to explode. 
Every other person walks around with nosebleeds, and the rest keep wiping stains of blood from their eyes to keep them from overflowing. It's <laughs> to do with the WoW trying to free Ross somehow, for sure. Wow. At this point, I wouldn't be surprised if the body just got up and left. Rally Herber, our dispatcher, has been snooping around asking questions she shouldn't. She says she's going down into the abyss to find Alpha. I can't bring myself to stop her. Recharge your then power banks. Power back. That's what that guy has on his face over here. See me. Dude, move! You just gonna stand there? It's just not even scary anymore. Like it's just like Yeah, I don't know. Let's go right the bottom floor. 
I think that's the battery. Right, the power pack. No. Downstairs is not that way. This way. Sorry, I have to override you first. I forgot. Already open. Cortex chip, here we go. Okay, Danzo. Let's go. Now I have to get to this second floor. Medical bay. Shut it. the door. Oh. What? What's going on? There's something out there. We managed to piss off another one of WoW's monsters. We have everything we need, right? Yeah. Let's get to work. Is that my? Is that my head? Make sure it's all bunched together with the structure gel connecting all the parts. Alright, try activating the suit from the terminal again. I don't know, eh? I can't believe we're doing this. It will be fine. Then why don't we put you in the suit? I was gonna suggest that if you refused. You go without me. I need to do this, Simon. This is important. I need to launch the Ark. You'd really do it? Change body? Yes. If you want to stay here, I'm not going to stand in your way. I don't want to tell you what to do. What would it be like before? Close my eyes and then... And then open them again. All right. Let's do it. Thank you, Simon. Go sit in the pilot seat in the next room. You might need to boot it up. We need to loop back the activity manifested by your current Cortex chip, run it through the amplifier, feed it into the new chip, and then make sure it's synced. There's 
You lost me halfway there. You don't really need to understand it. Just make them line up. That's everything. You can climb into the pilot seat now. Some of these puzzles are so... Everything under control. So please, have a seat. Go sit in the pilot seat. Sorry about any discomfort. This should be over soon. It's like having a picture taken. But with the most expensive camera in the world. You know, Indians thought photos would steal their souls. In this case, they'd be right. <laughs> Was that? No, I it's just why was it still talking? It's the same like before. Catherine, why was he still talking? That's how it works, you know that. What do you mean? You know it's not magic. You were copied. The sleeping Simon in the seat was copied, and now you are here, just like Simon lived on in Toronto. God damn you, Kath. Two Simons? There can't be two Simons. What did you think would happen? That you were gonna take my mind and put it into another body, like a brain transplant. I'm sorry, it wouldn't work that way. You realize how messed up this is? Please, I didn't mean to upset you. How did you expect me to react to this shit? Please stop. You're fucking disgusting. What's gonna happen to him? He'll sleep for a while, a few days. And then what? Wake up in this fucking nightmare again? All alone? Oh, so cruel. Well, what do you want me to do with him? Make friends? Let him know that we have to leave him behind when we go into the abyss? What if... What if he didn't need to wake up? You do that? I don't know. Yeah, I'll do it. Maybe. I'll do it. There. I set it up for you. Where? Hit the switch if you want to drain his battery. He'll die within a minute. I'd rather not stay plugged in any longer. Which switch? There you go, buddy. It's just a copy. Goodbye. That's the end of the video, goodbye.